Hello and welcome to the 5 Tech Show. In this episode, I am presenting some good smartphones under rupees 10,000. So, let's get started. First on the list is Redmi Note 3. Redmi Note 3 has a 2GB RAM and a 16GB ROM along with a 1.4GHz Snapdragon 650 quad-core processor and has a 5.5-inch Full HD display and comes with Android Lollipop out of the box. Now for the camera, it has a 16 megapixel front and 5 megapixel rear sensors along with a dual tone flash. Pros The best part is its battery life. With a 4000 mAh battery, which can last for a minimum of one and a half day, you will not have to carry a battery pack with you. And the other good thing about the device is that it has one of the fastest fingerprint scanner at this price range. Second on the list is Leco One S Echo. This device comes with a 1.8 GHz MediaTek Octa-Core processor along with 32 GB ROM and 3 GB RAM and supports a 5.5 inch Full HD display with very thin bezels. And for the camera part, it supports a 16 megapixel rear and 5 megapixel front camera. Pros, good battery life, fingerprint scanner, which is very fast and responsive. Cons. UI is not user-friendly and I would suggest using a launcher on it. Third on the list is Coolpad Note 3 Plus, which is a successor to their hit mobile Note 3. The mobile is very well built and the device supports a 16GB ROM and a 3GB RAM with 5.5-inch Full HD display at 401 ppi. It is powered by a 1.3GHz octa-core processor and has a 13MP and 5MP camera along with Android Lollipop out of the box. Pros Elegant design with gold color and a 3000 mAh battery. Cons Not a worthy upgrade over their Note 3 smartphone and the camera are very decent in their performance. Fourth on the list is Mizu M3 Note. Great structure and build quality. Feels premium in the hand with a 5.5 inch Full HD display. 3 GB RAM 32GB ROM and a 1.8GHz octa-core processor. It also has a 13MP back and 5MP front facing camera. Pros, beautiful design and a fast fingerprint scanner and a good back camera as well. Cons, decent front facing camera and very decent user experience. Fifth on the list is Asus Zenfone Max for Rs. 8999. As always, very well built by ASUS. It supports a 5.5-inch 720p HD display along with 16GB ROM and 2GB RAM. It is powered by 1GHz Qualcomm quad-core processor and for the camera, it has a 13MP primary and 5MP secondary sensors. Pros Good build quality and smooth gaming experience. Cons No fingerprint scanner. Thank you for watching this week's The 5 Tech Show. If you like the video, hit that thumbs up button and do let me know your choice of smartphone in the comment section. Thank you for watching.